happening guys, I hope we're all good out there. Ooh, I'm just going to stop the van here for a second. Because we've got some white stocks in that field. But I hope we're all doing good out there. Um, we have checked out the hotel and we are heading towards... Uh, one of our followers got in touch with us and they said come up to our bit because we've seen bison basically outside their house for the last two days I think it was. So that was an hour away, right, so we're just driving up there nice and slowly. It's beautiful countryside, when you're driving through the forests, it's really thick forests and then you come out and it's like beautiful open meadows, but we'll show you that in a second. But now it's just here, getting ourselves all spruced up, looking all beautiful. Rawr. Yes, look at our pointy toes. Beautiful. And look at the colour of the fields, look at the yellow wildflowers there. Stunning. And then over this side, we've got a few houses and over there we've got some storks. We're just walking through the field just now, just looking for some mice. Anyway, we've only got another 20 minutes until we get to this house, so let's crack on. I mean, look at that bit there. Branches are snapped. So that has got to be from a bison. Coming out here, going in there. And then over here, straight through there. It's got to be. The elusive European bison. European bison that we can't find. Look at this. Two Dalmatians going for a walk. Boys taking them a walk. Well, taking them a drive. Off you go, guys. Right, our search continues. Ah, uh, we're definitely in the right place because there's just loads of tramp grass in there. So that's what someone was saying to me, the bison do. First thing in the morning, they're out in the corner of the fields and then they get something to eat and then they just come into the woods during the day. But the woods are that dense here, but finding them will be quite tricky. But we will persevere and we will find them. So, so these are the fields that they're coming to. First thing in the morning, so I think tomorrow it's about four o'clock. Um, and just have a wee walk about this area. We're just coming, you can see all the grass all being trampled. Getting their bellies full and then heading back into the woods. But we're not going to be out smarted if I yet. We will see some bison before we leave. I've got all the time in the world. Look at that, yeah. Right, look at this wee path here. The most flattened all that grass. Has to be a bison. Our follower that we're meeting, um, their house is just one minute up here. So let's go and park the car and say hello. Let's go. Hello. Look at this cool place. How cool is this? So you had to do your blood at the drone, huh? So this is where the bison cross the tracks.
Firefox. Bison cheddar. Yes. It's very good for tomato. There we go, bison footprints. That's a big meal, he says. Not close, yeah. So, I think we're just gonna camp up over here some, somewhere, and then first thing in the morning, that's when you're meant to see them. But there's been lots of footprints coming over there, crossing down there, so they're definitely kicking about. found a bison. It's absolutely massive though. Um, I don't want to get too close. But I'm going to just put that on the camera in a second because it's too far away for the GoPro. So way down here in the field. Um, I'm quite far away for the van but I'm going to get it on the camera and I'm going to start heading back. I think I'll get too close to it. This is what they put up as well for the bison just to come and eat the hay. Ah, it is, it's massive, it's a, on its own as well. Right, let me get the big camera on. Right, so I'm standing in their field, um, next to their feeder, probably not the best bit. And look at this. I'd rather be doing this with a tour guide like. Come on, big guy, he's looking at me. Get up. Let's get a wee video of him as well, eh? Yes! Back to get messy. We'll bring her down here. So I've at least got somewhere safe-ish to run. But the ends are massive. And I'm so chuffed I've seen one. I've not even seen one. There's one and there's about ten down there. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> So that's where I'm going to leave the van and just going to go for a wee donder through this grass. Look, this is all bison tracks here. This is the way they've been coming. Definitely. That's crazy, they've just totally disappeared now. They were all down there. One big one was down here, but I just didn't know what get surrounded, so Nessie is now over here. Still quite far away, but you better believe I'll get to her in time if there's a bison chasing me. But I'm just going to sit chill here for a bit. 
there's a wee bird watchtower over there that'd be pretty cool to get to but I don't know how to get to it Right guys, it's 10 to 6 just now. I have been invited for dinner back at that house with the family. So am um, I going to start heading back there slowly. She's just up, Nala's just up here sound asleep. Look her giving herself a wee cuddle. She's sound. Um, the bison never came back out after I went back and got Nessie. I'm a wee bit gutted I never stayed out a wee bit longer just to watch them but I just envisioned bison coming out from everywhere because it started coming out of the forest and I just thought if it started coming from behind me as well then I'd be in trouble. So we're still going to search for them later on and we're still going to have a look for them at 4 o'clock in the morning as well and that's when you're meant to see them. But anyway we've ticked bison off the list so I'm chuffed with that and aye let's head back for some dinner. Let's go. Oh big jump. Yes. I'll be back in a minute there. They've got a couple of dogs. Yeah, one of them's like Kieran cats so... We just have to wait here, girl. Yes. We back soon. Look how beautiful this place is. Absolutely stunning. Gorgeous flowers. Hello, hello, how are you? Come on in. Hello, hello. Hey, dog. Hello. How are you all good? Yeah. Yeah. I was passing him by twice. Oh, yes, look at this. Sauce, uh, mm -hmm. The character is soya sauce with garlic. How to, you know, uh, take care of this. If you want, you can see after, later. It's um, behind this uh, fence. fence yeah, yeah. Bees. Nah, cool. Right, guys. Absolutely amazing night. Um, after dinner, we came back out into the fields. And we got to sit and watch the bison again. I didn't get many good pictures of them, but I did get a few good videos. Um, the camera just wasn't picking up enough light for the pictures. So I'll put the videos up on screen now. So me and Nala are now back out in the field. We're camping right next to it. Hoping to be up about four o'clock. Here she is. Right. Hoping to be up about four o'clock um, to go and start looking for bison again. See if we can get any more good photos. Because the first time I rushed it, second time it was losing light. So tomorrow, third time lucky, get some good videos and pictures. Uh, where we're camping though, so we're right on the edge of the field where there's the bison were. And I don't know if you can see it, but there's a path here that the bison have been using. So. We might get woke up by Nessie getting tipped over during the night. Um, anyway, I think it's 12 o'clock just now, so we'll see you all in four hours. Good night. Good morning, guys. So, just woke up, it's four o'clock. Um, I woke up, looked out the window. We've got five bison just over here, look. But now we've seen the bison, we can head to Lithuania. Right, let's go back and see Nala. Let's start up Nessie. And I will head back around here, see if we can see any more. See if we can see any foxes or anything. And then I think we'll head back to the house about 8 o'clock maybe. I mean it's half four just now so we've got plenty of time. 
But um, I might as well keep looking for some more. Yes. I need to get a better tripod for it. That's obviously no design for a big camera like that. So when it's up there, it sort of wobbles a wee bit. Hello. Yes, were you watching the bison out the window? Yes. Jump up there. Yeah, you'll be thinking you've hit the jackpot at five o'clock in the morning. Thinking it's breakfast now. No, too early for breakfast. Mm -hmm. Anyway, we're going to start up Nessie and we're going to go for a wee drive just down here. Um, over here on the left is where we've seen them last night. Um, I'll show you that spot. And then... Aye! And then we'll just have a wee drive about and we'll probably head back to that house. So, let's go. Can you see it? Can you see the big bison? That's the bison just over there, that wee black dot. Just a single male. It's amazing just sitting watching them. Can you see him? He's sitting watching you. He's sitting watching you. There goes that's a bison just over there. Come go, he's huge. Come on then, big jump. Look at you. Yes, oh, big stretch. Big stretch, my girl. So we'll give Nala a wee walk, let her stretch her legs. Uh, we'll go round to the house and say goodbye to everyone. Um, they were kind enough to feed us last night and they did offer us to stay round the back of their house with a van, although we opted for staying in the woods. But um, aye, they've been absolutely brilliant and they've got an Airbnb so I'll put the link down below. It looks like a really cool place um, so if anyone wants to check out that. And aye, we'll go and say our goodbyes and then we'll start driving because today we are heading towards Lithuania. I don't think we're going to get all the way there today but I think we're going to get right before the border and then tomorrow we'll cross over into Lithuania. So that's the plans but first let's just walk Nella.
Uh, she's happy eating the grass. Come on, you. In we go. Let's go and say good morning. Yo. Hello. Hello. Now I was down here somewhere. Annoying the chickens. She's away under there. Chickens are wondering what's going on. Beautiful garden. There we go, we're going to put Nala in the van just now because she went for chase a dog. Total puffed up, hissed. And poor Chase didn't know what was going on, so he was gone. Good girl. Oh, perfect for <laughs> Look at that. It's beautiful with the house in the background yeah. as well and the yellow yeah, flowers. Yeah, yeah. Right, well, thank Bison. you very much. Bison man. <laughs> yeah. Excellent. <laughs> and thank you very much. <laughs> Your cooking, both of you, has been absolutely perfect. So yeah. thank you very much for that. And nice talking to you, though. Yeah. <laughs> See you. Nice meeting you. Yeah, perfect. And if I'm ever coming back through again, I'll give you a message. You know. Of course. Come and yeah. Come on. We will chase some bison. Yeah, exactly. exactly. <laughs> it's moose next we need to fight. It's moose. <laughs> ah, oh. Big jump! Big jump! Big jump! Cheers guys! Right, that's us on the move again guys, we actually stayed for one extra night, um, such a beautiful place, just totally in nature, uh, so relaxing, so if that's up anyone's street, I will put the link down below, oh and their food by the way as well, um, just absolutely beautiful homemade food, so uh, if that's up anyone's street, I'll put the link down below and you just can check it out, anyway our plans now, we're just going to slowly drive towards Lithuania, I think we're going to stay one more night in Poland tonight, and, and aye, we'll update you more later on, so let's drive.